While in prayers and fasting on 1st August 2022, the Lord spoke to the man of God Apostle Fred to pray against the pre-election violence. This is what he said. I was in prayer in a particular prayer mountain uh, this afternoon. And uh, the Lord spoke to me. I was in the middle of prayer. And he said, let us pray against pre-election violence. Machafuko ya kabla ya uchaguzi. Ile jambo ambao imekuwa zito kidogo ni kwa sababu wale ambao wanastahili kuhakikisha kwamba haijafanyika wengine wao ndio wahusika wa kujaribu kuona kwamba kumekuwa na machafuko kabla ya uchaguzi. Nasikia kutoka kwa Bwana. On the same week on 4th August 2022, the deputy president Ruto, one of the presidential candidates gave a press briefing concerning the Indian plots of the violence by some of the government officials. But we are concerned about a couple of things that are going on in Kenya. We are concerned, and that is why we are here today. We are concerned about meetings that are being organized in dark places to orchestrate disharmony, to orchestrate conflict, and to plan what is not good for Kenya. Recently, the president met people in Nakuru, and the outcome of that meeting Is not good for our country. These leaflets are not innocent. There are people known by the state behind these leaflets. And the intention of these, of these leaflets and pamphlets are to cause panic in the population and to create a situation that will foment citizens fearing to go and vote. The regional commissioner, Mali Muhammad of Rift Valley, the county commissioners, Samson Ojuang of Transoya, and Stephen Kehara of Wazintishu, and Erastas Mbui of Nakuru, are part of this scheme. They are the people holding night meetings to orchestrate and to plan conflict among us Kenyans. And unfortunately, the President of Kenya is aware that we push back every pre-election violence scheme. And uh, the Lord made it known to me but it is not a small thing. Let's pray against demonic assassinations geared towards causing uh, unrest in diverse places. Pray for all leaders. May the Lord preserve our nation, preserve all our leaders during this time. In the name of Jesus.